Welcome back, ladies, to another quick installment of Julian's Random Projects. Now, someone recently asked me on Instagram why I welcome ladies back uh, occasionally on videos. Uh, YouTube actually provides analytics and demographics for all of my videos, and there's a large cadre of women that watch the channel. Now, I don't know if it's my good looks or my cracking wit, but something's drawing y'all in, so welcome. So in today's video, I'll be showing you a quick and cheap way to heat your pool. How cheap? Below 125 bucks cheap. So let's get started. First, order up a number of these solar heater mats. Don't go all DIY and waste a bunch of time. These things are designed and built for the purpose. And at 20 bucks, they're basically free. You'll also want to get a simple 12 volt bilge pump. You don't need one of the big ones that's going to move a ton of water or, or volumes of water, as you'll see later. The pump is only drawing about 50 watts, uh, so it's less than a light bulb's worth of power. So like I said, we've got the little 50 watt pump uh, pushing water in through this first bladder. Uh, it gets quite hot, and then it goes the next one, gets a little bit hotter, and so on and so forth, to so daisy chaining all the way through these, and then back out that hose. This one would be ideal to have it be black. Uh, the other thing that you can do to get a little bit more heat uh, out here is to get these up off this concrete floor. Now, the concrete floor is hot, but not as hot as these are getting. So it's, it's all relativity, right? Like the, the, the delta is what we're trying to um, to deal with here. And so this is this, although it's hot and you don't want to walk around on it barefoot for too long, um, is is actually cooling this bladder here. And so if you put some sort of an insulator underneath here, uh, anything, a beach towel or a bit of styrofoam or something, uh, you'd get this thing to be up even higher in temperatures. But um, this, I, I'm trying to keep it temporary so that on, on the pool days when we get you know, the kids coming over to, to splash around in the pool, a couple days before I'll deploy this that will raise up the temperature slowly over a couple days uh, even through the night there's some capacitance uh, to the water here it'll hold the heat quite a bit and each day it just steadily gets hotter and hotter and hotter uh, or warmer and warmer and then the day of a larger pool party we don't have kids you know coming around here tripping over this thing it's temporary enough where I can just unhook the hoses, pull in the pump, and stow this thing away back here where all the pumps and things are, so, or the, the pool cleaning equipment as it is. So I'll leave a link to these down in the description. They're super cheap. They're meant for above ground pools, but uh, they don't seem to know the difference. And it's been doing a pretty good job. So like I said, it's all about the deltas here. The system seems to be increasing the temp by about seven degrees science or 20 degrees American. So my 70 degree pool will eventually be 90 degrees, given enough time and sun. Or if you have a small pool, like the hot tub here, you can keep circulating it and get well over 100 degrees. And those temperatures put you into hot bath territory. You're also gonna wanna make sure you subscribe to get more useful projects like these. And because people will ask, links to some of the items that we use today are down in the description. Be safe around your pool and have fun. Yeah, yeah,